My matter tonight is for the Minister for Health, and the action I seek is for the roadmap out of lockdown to have more than two regions. Let me be clear, there shouldn't be any restrictions left on most of regional Victoria at all. The majority of regional Victorians haven't been within hundreds of kilometres of a coronavirus case even once. Where there have been coronavirus infections, they've been modest and quickly contained. But if the government insists on restrictions on regional Victoria through its roadmap, it should at least do, the, do it sensibly. Regional Victoria is now still in the relief stage of being allowed to cross to step three tomorrow. But to progress any further, there are a series of criteria that will apply right across the state. Right now, people will not be able to go to church in Wodonga if someone in Mildura, Malakuta, Nelson or Geelong has caught coronavirus in the preceding two weeks. We can't move to the next step of this so-called roadmap in North East Victoria if anyone anywhere outside of Melbourne gets sick. This is beyond stupid. It is, it's absurd. Set aside that an elimination strategy is futile and wasteful, and so the goal of no coronavirus cases for 14 and 28 days for the next steps on the roadmap doesn't work, but even if these goals were sensible, grouping Victoria into Melbourne and everywhere that's not Melbourne shows nothing but contempt for the people of regional Victoria. I know that to Melbourne politicians, everything outside the ring road seems to be one place far away, a place you've most likely never visited and probably never will, but the vast space of regional Victoria are not the, the vast spaces of regional Victoria are not the same. If, God forbid, we have a coronavirus case in Malakuta, it shouldn't have any effect 800 kilometres away in Mildura. If somebody gets sick in Nelson, it shouldn't have any effect 700 kilometres away in Wodonga. If Geelong has another outbreak, it shouldn't affect any of us hundreds of kilometres away. We can progress to the next step by smaller geographic areas. Having conditions that rely on the whole of regional Victoria, the whole of Victoria, or indeed the whole of Australia, are merely steps to no progress at all. I call on the Minister to treat regional Victoria as, a separate, as separate areas to progress to the next steps in the roadmap.